Sometimes when I'm thinking about us Before we got lost and we parted Back to back we would carry on then We'd do anything for what we started But this time we could break Hey friends, thanks so much for watching. Welcome back to my channel. And if you are new here, thank you so much for clicking on today's video. Today is a relaxing weekend cleaning motivation video. I just wanted to give you guys a little bit of motivation on this Sunday. Valentine's Day is the day that I'm posting this. So happy Valentine's Day to all of you. Let me know in the comments what you guys are doing for Valentine's Day, or if you're watching this later, let me know what you ended up doing. I think we're just gonna kind of hang out here at my house. I'm making a cheesecake and a really yummy dinner and I'm just gonna probably keep it low key but anyway thank you guys so much for watching this video give it a thumbs up if you enjoy it and if you're new here please consider subscribing before you go I would love to have you and let's jump into all the cleaning so I'm starting out in my kitchen as I do in a lot of my cleaning videos because I needed to unload the dishwasher and this is usually the space in my house that needs the most attention. So I'm gonna clean out the sink and wipe down the countertops and then I have a little bit of laundry to do in this video as well as just cleaning the bathroom and some normal weekend tasks. I feel like I save everything up and get it all done in one day and I just think that's because I'm so busy right now with teaching and everything else that's going on that I don't really have time to like clean throughout the week so I save everything until the weekend and then usually this kind of thing happens on a Saturday or on a Sunday but you guys will have to let me know what you do down in the comments are you kind of more of a little bit here and a little bit there cleaner or do you like to save it all up until one day in the week recently picked up this method dish soap and this is the first time I have used it personally I've seen a lot of my girlfriends here on YouTube use this dish soap in their cleaning videos before and I was really curious to try it out and the reason I had to get it is because I actually ran out of dish soap I normally am on top of it and I order on the Grove collaborative whenever I am getting kind of low on cleaning products but for some reason I just didn't have any more dish soap and so I did like a Target run and picked this up from Target and I have to say I'm pretty impressed with it. It is definitely really good smelling. I think this one is pomegranate or honey crisp apple or I don't know something like that it was like a really fresh scent and I really enjoyed it and I definitely think it did get my dishes super clean but you guys will have to let me know do, what is your favorite kind of dish soap I tend to use Mrs. Myers all the time that's just my go-to but let me know what you guys like to use down below I won't be stumbling in the dark your eyes are shining like the stars I was down until you saved me, until you set me free. My eyes were closed, now I see clear as day. And I just wanted to say that you can take me high. Feels like I can fly. You can take me high. I can see the sun staring at you when you make that smile I'm moving closer to you now I can't get close enough somehow I love this Jaws Granite Cleaner. It works so well. I've also used the Method one too. And both of them are really great at shining up your granite countertops. I don't use this every time I wipe down the countertops. Mostly I use just like a multi-surface spray, which is what I really like about multi-surface sprays is that you can just have one product that you use on pretty much everything and it's safe on almost all surfaces. But granite cleaners really do a good job at giving that extra polish and shine to the countertops. And you can really tell a difference in these clips. I don't need anybody, I don't need anybody else No one will ever take me, no one will ever take me away from you I promise I will hold on to you I don't know what I'd do without you mm -hmm. With 
without you. I'm moving all the kitchen chairs out of the kitchen so that way when I start the robot vacuum it just has less things to bump into and then I'm going to wipe down this table and you will notice that I'm using the method wood cleaner which is pretty much the only um, cleaner that I really like to use on this table. I'm trying to preserve it for as long as possible and I was actually kind of thinking about DIYing this table and kind of transforming it into more of a farmhouse style looking table either painting it or something like that. Let me know what you guys think down below if you have refinished a table before and you have any suggestions I would love to hear them I don't really need new friends so spend your time with me looking for someone who can play though wanna hang with me I'm not really looking for a friend so spend your time with me looking for someone not afraid of give it all to me get next to me get next to me all that I I had mentioned in my last cleaning video how much I absolutely hate these wipes and unfortunately I'm still making my way through them because they're a pack of 100 but my mom made a really good suggestion when she heard that they were like really dry and they weren't cleaning very well she suggested to add a little bit of water to the container to kind of like bring some new life back to the wipes which is a great idea never really thought of before so if you have any wipes even like the really expensive ones if you've accidentally left the lid open or something and they started to dry out if you add a little bit of liquid to them it should kind of reconstitute them and make them a little bit easier to clean with so I thought that was a really good hack We're moving on to the living room and I'm just gonna kind of tidy up in here I needed to put a few of the blankets in the washing machine I feel like with having a cat there's cat hair on pretty much everything so I needed to freshen those up and I was actually really excited to vacuum because um, Jack replaced the belt in my vacuum cleaner for me and I guess I didn't realize for a really long time that the vacuum cleaner belt was on its way out but now the vacuum cleans so much better than it has been for like the past five or six months so I'm really happy that now I'm getting a good Good clean when I use this vacuum cleaner I was thinking I was gonna have to replace it but most of you guys know how expensive vacuums are so I'm really glad that it was just the belt guys are enjoying this video please don't forget to give it a thumbs up it helps out my channel so much and we're gonna move on to some laundry I'm gonna fold up a few of the towels and things that I had washed and then we're finally gonna get on to mopping the floors and I have a few other spaces I need to vacuum now that my vacuum cleaner is in pristine shape 
Just the two of us and we could stay up all night Kissing under street lights Doing what we want to Doing what we need to do Staying up all night Everything is alright Oh, I wanna be with you Oh, I wanna be with you Let me be the time Sometimes I mop here in the laundry room, but other times I just use this floor spray from the Grove Collaborative and I use a couple of microfibers and I just kind of clean the floor by hand. It's such a small space that honestly I feel like I get a much better clean when I wipe down the floor myself. There's also on the other side of the wall here, you can't see it in this clip, but there is um, some paneling that we put up and then I always like to wipe down the baseboards too, so I find it a lot easier if I just do it by hand. And now we're gonna move on to mopping the main floor. I'm just adding a little bit of my Mrs. Meyers multi-surface concentrate into the bucket, and then we are going to make these floors nice and clean. Since you guys can see our air fryer in this clip, I thought this would be a good time to ask you guys if you're interested in some more what's for dinner videos or any kind of food videos. I feel like I haven't made one in a really long time on my channel and I had asked you guys over on Instagram the other day whether you wanted to see a few more videos like that and a lot of you said yes. I do tend to share like daily recipe things on Instagram just because it's so much faster but if you guys would like me to share that kind of stuff over here too, then let me know down in the comments. put the chairs back under the table and then lay all the rugs back down on the floor. I just love having a clean floor. There is truly nothing better. I have two more rooms to vacuum up and then that's gonna be it. This was a true whole house clean with me.
like the carpet lines are so much more satisfying now too that the vacuum cleaner is fixed. I noticed it immediately as soon as I started vacuuming that I could actually see that it was cleaning. So I feel so good now that this is all done. But that is going to be it for today's video. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed it, please don't forget to give it a thumbs up. And if you're not subscribed to my channel, please be sure you do that before you go and give me a follow on Instagram if you're not already following me over there too. And I will see you guys again really soon with a brand new video. Bye guys. Thank you.